Hey guys, welcome back to another video today, and today we're going to be going over boats. And as you all do know, boats are going to be pretty important in this update because you're going to need one to rob the new oil rig robbery. But if you all do know, the boats have been glitchy, like all of them are not really working that well. Just feel boats just haven't been really touched at all, so it's been buggy and outdated, and yeah, frankly, I don't even know where all of them spawn because I don't even use them. But that is all about to change, so let's go ahead and uh, dive right into the news. Okay. So over here, Badima says, we're excited to announce the new Speed Yacht, sail in style with six friends at a high speed. A great choice for your upcoming oil rig heist. Priced at $250,000, click show more. So this is all information they got. So we have price changes. So the cruiser will now be free. Think of it as the Camaro of the sea. And the jet ski is moving from $25,000 to $50,000. So existing cruise owners will receive a full refund. So this is the new yacht. And you can see a really cool picture of the oil rig robbery really up close. We didn't really get to see that. So there it is. And uh, this is the new yacht. There's six seats right there. There's uh, some more images. So this one, it's been customized. Looks like the seats are yellow this time. And finally, this is the one. I, okay, I guess it's like a front shot of it. Not gonna lie, I think this is really important because, I mean, and the boats aren't free in jailbreak. So I like how they're adding, you know, like a free boat so people can rob. It makes sense. Anyway, boats can now be disabled when shot at. Before, uh, you can't really do that. Texture support for cruise and slope. I mean, that makes sense because before they didn't work. New sailing and turning physics so they completely got rid of like the old boat chassis you know how the boats move and stuff the old they completely updated it so they changed it and then uh, new left and right turning animations i guess improve stability on all boats and new tunes that's important and then fix the sinking cruiser fix rain related speed issues i think that may be a problem and then fix fps related so they did fix all the bugs with the boats now if i do remember correctly i believe the cruiser is at the power plant or something it should be right here I mean, otherwise, I really do not know where the boat is. Is it right here? Yeah, there's the cruiser. Okay, so but basically, there is a, a bug with it. Okay, yeah, you can kind of see. This definitely feels outdated because I feel like this is from, like, 2019, 2020, so... Yeah, it's been, it's been a while. I mean, I haven't really used this at all, so. Oh, I can see this being a problem. Look at this, guys. So if I just, like, stop out of nowhere, uh, it just sinks down. I mean, it could be better because you might not be seen by, you know, cops or criminals. So this could be a pretty good cover. But I guess that's the issue they were really concerned about, which I, I can see why. So they want this to be, like, the Camaro of the Sea. Basically, to get around, you know, with the default vehicle, this will be it, the cruiser. Now, the jet ski is going to be up to 50000 So hopefully that means there may be, I don't know, I actually like the jet ski because it goes really fast and hopefully I don't get rid of the speed there's been times where it's glitchy where it doesn't go that fast so uh, I just I just hope they don't change the speed of it because I really like how fast and how fast accelerates anyway that's pretty much it for today's video just want to go over all the new information of the boats and stuff so let me know down below what you guys think and yeah I'll catch you guys in my next video bye